Hello guys and welcome to Squidgy Face Plays and in today's video I'm going to be playing Dan Rob's Prob's new map Spawn Block. Um, now he briefly has shown me this map obviously we work together you know that so I kind of know what this map's about but I haven't actually played it. Um, I feel like it's going to be one of those maps where I'm going to be get maybe a bit angry with it because it's just the kind of map it is but Let's get into it. So, Spawn Block, a map created by Dan Robs Probs. Hello! In the next few pages, you will learn about some of the basic mechanics of Spawn Block. In a quick summary, mob spawners now summon blocks as well as various other things. Um, to be honest, I don't need to read all this, um, but I'm going to leave it on screen right now just so you can um, quickly have a read of the book, you know, pause it and stuff like that. So, um, let's go over some of the settings. So, obviously, Default coordinates are on. Um, keep inventory default. Okay, that's false anyway. Um, we'll keep it normal. We'll keep it normal. Um, okay, random tick speed is one. That's the default. Oh, do I do it? See, I I know how this <laughs> world works. Uh, fine, we'll we'll keep it as one. We'll keep it as the default. Um, yeah, and we'll keep that as default as one as well. Okay. Oh, before I uh, go and start it, I just want you guys to know that this is going to be a one-time only thing. So if I die, that is it. I do not have a second chance. I do not get anything else. Oh, well, okay. That's quite lucky that it spawned right there. So as you can probably notice, this isn't like your normal sky blocks. There's not obviously anything straight away in spawn other than randomly spawning blocks hence the name spawn block um so the more blocks spawn the higher this stage goes so see how it says summon count 25 now uh no now um when that i think when that gets to 50 i think it changes to level two i think i'm not 100 percent sure i can't remember what dan said but it does progress in a very cool way so i'm just talking and waffling on a little bit so i i can essentially get more materials oh why would you <sighs> i'm basically letting things grow so i have more of a chance of not dying because this is how you get resources in this game and it's literally a simple mechanic but it works so well um what stage are we on right now okay we're on 64 okay so maybe it's not stage two is not 50 maybe it's 100 um see do i dare venture out and try and try and get some materials oh god i hate this oh no okay oh god okay okay, okay. it's fine ow okay if i crouch oh god's sake i was hoping i could get these like dirt why are they not no it's fine i won't get angry i won't get angry Okay, we've got a dirt block. We've got a dirt block. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. My plan is to... Why can't it... Can you not place that against honey? That's weird. Why can't I place blocks? That's my question right now. It won't let me place it close to the... Okay, so I don't think I can place it close to the spawn. If that's the case, that's very... It's very weird, but it's fine. We'll we'll take it anyway. Can I place it under the spawn? Oh, is it the spore blossom that stop? I don't know. I honestly don't know. So what are we at at the moment? Okay, we're at 139. Okay. So I don't have any other option other than to go out and explore, really, do I? Now, the best I can hope for was maybe some sort of tree or wood. Um... I can see quite a few barrels dotted around the place. Um, so there's one there. There's two over there. Uh, there's, there's, there is quite a few. But the issue with what I'm having is that it's... Um, yeah, it's a whole one-time deal thing. If I die, I die. Oh, God. I'm making this way too risky. You're probably watching me right now thinking it's not even that risky. Just jump. It's not hard. Oh! Oh my god. <laughs> that scared me. 
<laughs> that that legit just made me jump. Okay, so this is what's this on now? 100 nights. It's got like 200. Surely, Dan, come on. No. When does it go to? St I I probably should have read the book. I I'm only going what I remember Dan telling me. Oh my god! I didn't. Why did I not jump properly then? Okay. We need to get some more dirt. I'm definitely crouching. Okay. Okay, got some dirt. Okay. We're, we're, we're getting there, guys. We're, we're, we're putting, like, a little platform down. Um. Hmm. Oh, poor fuck. Did you hear him squeak? Okay, okay, okay. So, my plan right now is just to keep getting blocks and... Trying my best not to die. Um, we we realistically need a sapling or something. Um, oh, there we go. Upgrade. <laughs> this one has just upgraded to the wood stage. Okay. So now wood will start spawning. Hmm. There is an update block. What is that? It's, I, I've now got haste. That's... That's really weird. Why have I got an update book? Okay, so I've just had to quickly pause my game, message Dan, like, hey, what was going on? And quite honestly, it's just a bug with the game. That was indeed a lucky block. I was right. Um, but it's just an issue with the game, not the actual map, if that makes sense. So because the game updated mid-submission for this map, I guess... Then it caused an issue with textures. I get, I don't know, but they work anyway, so it's not like it's a big, a big issue really. Um, so we're gonna carry on. Like I said, we're gonna try and make a little safe-ish platform. I probably should have just turned them into slat. Oh, what the hell? Oh no. Oh no. What's going on? Oh god. That doesn't sound good. Is that just like a turtle? Oh okay, I thought it was flying. I was like, why is the turtle flying? Okay, uh, let's see if I can get some more wood. No, I can't. <laughs> okay, we'll we'll expand like this way like this. And then hopefully we can do something. I got beetroot seeds. Is this beetroot? Yeah, that's beetroot seeds. Oh, some nice pods all that'll do nicely. Um, no God. Okay, how am I? Oh, I just didn't think I could just break this block, right? Now, is this gonna be okay to place? There it is. Okay. Um. Hmm. What about the beehive? No, I can't break a beehive. Apparently. Um. Okay, so what if? It... Oh, okay. Random tree just spawned. That's that's very helpful. Okay, so now we just need to make our way over to said tree. And we should be okay. Now, like I said, this is a one life thing for me. So if I was to die, then that's going to be it. Game over for me. So, I'm going to make sure that doesn't happen. <laughs> but we never know. We never know what can happen. It's a, it's a funny old game. Um, I don't know what tricks Dan's got off his sleeve because I've only, like I said, I only saw this very briefly and I don't know, he could have done anything. So at least now we're going to be able to get some things actually going and making, I guess. And we won't be stuck. Oh, I just thought hopefully I can get some saplings and then hopefully it'll help. Okay, this no, this is the way to survive. We survive through wood, right? This is how we survive. We survive through the wood. Like that. See, look at that. Professional. <laughs> Absolute professional. Um, let's place these planks down. Okay, I'm gonna carry on. I'm gonna see how far I can get. Um I'm gonna keep gathering some resources and we'll see what we can get up to, I guess.
Oh, okay, so the spawner just upgraded to the stone stage. Okay. So, <laughs> I haven't even done much. I literally just started, like, thinking what I needed to craft, and then it upgraded. So, wait, what, so what are we on now? We're on stage three, and we're on 500. Okay, so that must mean every 250 blocks spawned, it changes. Which would make sense. So, what I'm thinking, if this is now stone stage, we're going to need a pickaxe, right? And I'm just going to get some slabs to also make our little platform a little bit bigger. Make it so, you know, we're at no risk of just randomly falling off and dying. I am going to try and make my way over to some chests, like that one there. And I think there's like a few... Oh, okay, there's one over there actually, like really close. Okay, so let's go that way. I'm not taking any chances when it... Oh, I'm crouched, aren't I? Oh, some shovels, some sand, some sugar cane. I'm also now hearing zombies, which I don't like. I'm actually going to break that so I know that I've already been there. Because obviously, I don't want to be like thinking, oh, I've not been to that one yet. So, I'm going to try and get to some of these other bits like this. It's just so I know that when that grows... Oh, spruce was over there. Okay. Hmm... Oh, is that a charged creeper? Why? Why would he spawn a charged creeper into the world? Like, that is just cruel. Okay, um, oh no, great. It's night time, which means everything's gonna spawn now. Oh no. Oh god. Why does Dan do this to me? Like, I'm not... Oh god. Okay. We're making our way downtown. No, um, we're making our way to the, some more loot chests. Can we get... Ah, ha, ha. <gasps> Ooh! This is what I wanted. I wanted some like, quite a bit of wood. But also, it's now night time and I've just got some torches. That is some good, 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 goodness right there. <gasps> oh my god, what is... The... Why? Oh my god. <laughs> Why is there a charged creeper? Jesus. But here's the issue, right? These blocks are just randomly spawning. So I'm not safe, I don't think. I really don't think I'm safe. So these things can spawn anywhere at any time. Hmm. That then leaves the, the issue of... Do I build? Because, like, is all my builds going to be safe? This is something that we're going to have to investigate for ourselves. I get... Oh, of course I didn't get it. Oh, my... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my... G oh, my God. I'm not going to lie to you. A part of my soul just left my body. <laughs> What are you doing to us, Dan? Jesus Christ. Jesus. Oh my God. Oh my good giddy on. Whew. That's, uh, he's testing out the old ticker there. Oh. What was that noise? What was that? Oh my. Uh, I don't like it. Okay, this might have been the wrong map for me to be playing right now oh my god i'm gonna try and keep the place lit up because i know mobs can't spawn now with the new mob spawning rules in like complete they have to be in complete darkness right so oh crafting there i could have done with that earlier but it's fine some more sh does dan love shovels why is he putting shovels in these loot crates oh for <sighs> Oh, okay, a bow, some gravel, some sand. Okay, we can we can do something with this, I guess. Uh, I'm just going to crouch and just get... Oh, probably shouldn't use a pickaxe for that. Like I said, I'm going to crouch and get rid of the things I don't really want to be trying to reopen, if that makes sense. Um, I'm going to go back, make some more slabs. Probably make this whole area a bit safer for myself. Now, do I use clay blocks? I mean, it's not exactly safe, but 
I don't plan on destroying it anytime soon. So we've got we've got a bit of a platform going. It's not too bad. Let's get some of this uh, mossy cobble. Oh no, I didn't mean to destroy my wheat. Um, what is that? Are you spawning random silverfish? No, what? Oh no, 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 no! This could be it for me. Oh my, oh my god! Oh my, no, 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 no! Okay, I think I'm safe. Oh my god. I, giving that extra challenge of making it so like I've only got one life is really... Has really made this hard. Okay. Um, I can still hear, I can still hear silverfish just randomly spawning. And that charge creeper is not going away. Okay. Okay, Dan. I I get it. You're you're very cruel. Oh jeez. So what stage are we on? What are we on now? Okay, we're on seven, eight, four. So wait. So it didn't go to stage four. It just gives us the lightning. I think. Okay. Stay crouched at all times. Hopefully. Um. Where was I going? I was doing something. I just got distracted by the silverfish and stuff. Ah, crafting. Crafting tea. I thought I saw a creeper. I, <laughs> uh, I was making some slabs. That's what I was doing. I was making more slabs. This is dangerous. What if I'm... What if I'm walking and... All of a sudden, a random, just a random block. Have I got an axe? I don't have an axe. What if I'm walking in a random block, just like loading, and I just get knocked off? That's it. Game over, right? I'll be honest. I'm, I'm enjoying this quite a bit. I've, I, it's a new challenge for me. I usually play, you know, like a standard sky block or even just like a modded type sky block. But no, I'm, uh, I'm really enjoying this. Um... Okay, I should probably crouch because this is really... Oh, there's a zombie over there. But we're not going to go to you, zombie. We're going to go over here. To this chest. Oh, <laughs> an OG stone cutter. It's not even the modern stone cutter, so it's not even that useful. But it has given me a stone... Oh, I did have an axe. Um, But it has given me a stone sword, so I'll let him off with that. Okay, so some reason we've got an OG stone cutter... Um, okay, let's go back to the spawn. I keep hearing silverfish and I really don't like it. Oh, there's a baby zombie too? Jesus. Okay, there's a bone block there, but I don't know if I can be able to get it before it breaks. That's my thing. Oh, oh, no, no. No, no, no. No. Oh. Of all the things, all the things that could happen, all the things that could happen, and a stupid skeleton spawns in and starts mullering me in a... Oh, I just... So there we have it. That was spawn block. I'm probably going to just spawn back in and there's going to be a skeleton right there. To glow squids. Um, that was spawn block. Like I did say, this was going to be... The moment I die, that was it. End of for me. So yeah, um, if you like what you see, go go to the store. It should be in a link somewhere down in the description. I'll leave it all linked down. You can go download this map for yourself. It's made by my good friend Dan Rolls Probs. And yeah, that's it. I'll see you guys in another video. Bye.